So you had a big night. You had to close the show. Right, it's a lot of responsibility. I mean, does that change your mindset when you're going into numbers? or? Nah. Um, I always like to try to have the best time I possibly can on stage, and did that tonight, so no regrets. Yeah. Well, and you had two numbers to show off your singing abilities tonight, so did you find your approach for rehearsals, etc., was different this week because you did have to take on two songs? Yeah, um, it's, it's two songs. Um, I love the White Stripes, and I love I fell in love with the girl, but for some reason I was having trouble learning all the lyrics and getting them down. Um, and, and bearing in mind that I was also singing another song that's literally just completely the opposite of this other song I was doing. Um, uh, it was tough. It was tough to, in such a short amount of time, under such duress and doing so much work at once, to, to really invest myself in the performances. But um, I got myself to a place um, which is where I try to bring myself to every week, which is, James, why do you do this? And I answer myself, James, because I love music. And, uh, you know, my job on this TV show, like amidst all the other people whose jobs are to like, are, are to promote and do press and uh, work backstage and get sets set up. My job is to do music. And um, I try my best to do my job. And you are a little sick, it seems, as well? Oh, yes. I, I don't expect anybody to take that um, as an excuse or uh, right. um, or even as a as a pass for any kind of, any, any lacking moments in my performances. I, I, what I would like most is for people to approach my songs and my performances as objectively as possible um, because I think that's the, that's fair that, I mean that's what's fair to my fellow contestants and I think that'd be fair to me more so than, than using the excuse that I was sick to compensate for anything because artists get up on stage and are expected to perform at their 100% potential all the time literally every day it happens so yeah I understand that I mean but did that make did that cause some stress for you because you know that you, you do have to perform at your highest ability every week because people are voting week by week. Um, I, I try to kind of divorce myself from that mentality and like thinking about each of my performances as like gauging whether or not they're successful based on what people think of them. Uh, I, I, I try to get away from that because it's, it's not very healthy in the long run. Um, but I mean it's tough because it's competition and it's kind of impossible to get away from that. I'm just really excited and also but I mean, I think the idea is to be as grounded and down to earth as you possibly can, uh, because getting stuck in your own little bubble about it is going to make it even worse. I mean, I only got sick this morning, thankfully. That's good. Uh, well, not that. I'm not that. No, that's great. It was very, very frustrating this morning when yeah. I found out when I noticed that it was. Gonna, I didn't get any sleep last night. I was like just up, um, being sick and stuff. But, um, thankfully, it didn't make the week any more stressful. That's, that's good, at least. I mean, I know you mentioned that you had trouble learning some of the lyrics from one of the songs, but was there a particular, do you feel one of your performances was stronger than the other, or do you feel they were both evenly matched and showed up the best sides of you? Uh, I just think they were just like totally different and fairly incomparable. I, I, I would say that the last one was probably uh, more bombastic and outrageous and crazy, which I think is going to... Because I think it was louder, I think it will be considered better. Um, but I mean, that's just my like hypothesis based on how people work. Right. Um, and also, it closed the show, so people will remember it a little more. Yeah. Well, given that there are so few of you left, and there's another cut coming, is there anything you really want to make sure your fans know before they vote tonight? I mean, you want to say to them? Just that I love doing music. I'm really happy to be working for you guys. And uh, there's still more to come. I still have more ideas. I have um, more cards to show. Um, and I can't. I can't wait for tomorrow night, by the way, because tomorrow night's gonna be awesome. Is it like one of my favorite things is coming up tomorrow? Favorite things ever. And um, this isn't the end. Whatever happens, uh, this is just this is just the beginning.